Okay, scientists, in this video, I want to show you how to use a formula in sheets to calculate the total of a set of numbers you've entered into your spreadsheet and then find the average of those numbers. Um, sheets will probably give you an option to use something called the average function to do this. We're going to wait until later to do that so you can practice writing formulas in sheets. So what a formula does is it tells a spreadsheet how to determine the value of a cell. Like, for example, cell E4, which is the cell I've clicked on right here. It is in row 4 and column E. So its address is E4. And I want to give some instructions to the spreadsheet to tell the spreadsheet to display the total number of students that I've entered in cells B4, C4, and D4. Okay, so all formulas in sheets will start with an equal sign. So I'm going to start by typing in an equal sign in that cell. Now what you see here is the suggestion. Um, this is the sum function. We are going to skip that for now. And we are just going to tell it to add up the cells like this. Okay, so you don't want to tell it to add up the numbers that you see in those three cells. What you want to do is you want to tell it to add whatever number it finds in a particular cell, okay? Or to go to a cell and take whatever value is there and use it for whatever you want it to do. So we're going to tell the spreadsheet to go and find the numbers or whatever value is entered in cells B4, C4, and D4 and add them together. So to do that, you want to enter the address of the cell you're interested in. So we want the first number to come from cell B4. If I click on cell B4, it'll put the cell address in my uh, cell that I'm writing the formula. And then I'm just going to put a plus sign to show that I want it to add something to the value from B4. And what I want it to add is the value from C4. So I click on that cell as well. Okay, and then you might guess the next step, we're also going to add the value from D4. So what this formula says, it says, hey, spreadsheet, go to cell B4, take whatever values is there, and then add it to the values you get from cells C4 and D4. And when I hit enter, it'll give me a total. Okay, 84. 33 plus 24 plus 27 is 84. Okay, now in cell F4, I want it to find an average. And remember, to get an average, you take a set of numbers, you add them up, and you divide your total by however many numbers you had in that set. So we have three numbers here we've added up. So what I want to tell the spreadsheet to do in cell F4 is take that total and divide by three. So again, I start with an equal sign, and then I want to tell it to go get the total. So I'm going to click on cell E4, and that says, hey, spreadsheet, go get the number in E4 and do something with it. Okay? And what it's going to do is divide. So in a spreadsheet, the forward slash is the symbol you use for divide. Okay? So now I've told the spreadsheet, get the number from E4 and divide it by something. What do I want to divide it by? Three. Okay? Because I have three numbers in my set that I want to find the average of. I just type in a three. I hit enter, and it gives me my average. So for this data set, which is showing B-Day students in periods 5th, 6th, and 7th, um, with a total of 84 students, the average number of students in each class is 28. Hope that helps.